angalia hii program ninayo watch kwa TV is it adding value to my life angalia this friendship ama urafiki huu nilio nao una how does it contribute to the future i want to live is it something i listen to do they contribute to a bright future i want to live kwa hivyo chochote unachofanya jiulize kinachangia vipi maisha ya usoni ambayo tunataka kuishi and limit yourself with the people of negative thoughts yani ubitenge na watu wa mawazo machafu nyinyi wenyewe mnasema unataka uwe msafi wa nini wa mawazo na matendo so limit yourself with the people of negative thoughts also do not conform to the patterns of this world yani usiige mitindo ya kisasa unapata wazazi wa regulations you have done good tumevalisha hawa watoto vizuri angalia vile wanavyokaa sasa mimi sijui mnatoa wapi hii mitindo ambayo kijana ananyoa unanyoa nywele yote huku na reza blend lakini hapa katikati pis zipo hapo tano au kumi unapata naye longi hapo walimbefu naye ni nusu ya makalio alafu mtoto anakuletea nyumbani anakwambia mama na baba this is your son in law atungependa hayo unasikia nini ya vile mlivyo hivi this is how uh, ama hivi ndivyo wazazi wenu wangependa mkuwe so msituaidishe na vile ninavyoangalia kuna kanisa kubwa hapa wadhami wadhami wacha tufuatilie watoto hawa tujue vile wanavyoendelea katika masomo yao katika shule katika jamii zao katika kanisa lao tusiwaje tu wacha tuwafuatilie tukifuatilia kanisa hili jameni hatutakuwa na shida ya kusema uh, shida ya kusema fulani hakwenda kanisa au fulani hakufanya hivi kwa hivyo wadhani tumejiwekea mzigo au huu ni mzigo wetu na watu hawa wakipotea kwa ajili ya uzembe wetu unajua ya kwamba dami uh, damu yao ndio yetu kwa hivyo tujitahidi tuwezavyo pamoja na wasimamizi wa makanisa tofauti wacha tufuatilie watoto hawa watoto tunawapenda sana tumefurahia kuwa hapa na tumefurahia kukubali kufundishwa na kukubali kuwekewa mkono wacha neno la Mungu likaweze kuwa taa ya mbinguni yenu the future is in your hands the past is in your head but the future is in your hands na nimesema you cannot blame anybody because of your bad future kwa hivyo Mungu atusaidie tukaweze kuishi maisha mazuri maisha ya kumpendeza Mungu na kwa ofisi wengine wote nasi pia tujitahidi tuishi maisha ya kumtegeza Kristo ili wakati mmoja tukaweze kukutana na yeye. Asante sana Mungu awabariki na wapenda wote. Ya lay readers chini ya evangelist chini ya mchungaji na chini ya deacon ili mkaweza kufundishwa hilo ni jambo kuu zaidi ambayo mmefanya na kile kilichonifurahisha kwa yale yote umefundishwa ni kwamba uliweza kusema natubu dhambi zangu zote
Tena ukasema ninamkubali Kristo. Kwa hivyo tuishi kama watu waliotubu dhambi zao. Kwa mama na wazee walioko hapa wala ambao wamewekewa mkono. Tuishi kama watu ambao wametubu dhambi zao na wamekubali Kristo. Kumbuka education sio tu education. Education is only education if you put into practice what you have learned. Yaani ni kuweka katika katika maisha yako yale ambayo umefundishwa. Unajua kuna watu wamefundishwa tailoring na hawezi hata kutengeneza skirt. Wengine wamefundishwa carpentry na hawezi wakatengeneza hata meza. Kwa hivyo hiyo inamaanisha hiyo education ilienda kure. Na sisi hatutaki education ya watu mliotaja hapa wale wote iende kure. Kwa hivyo tutilie maanani. Na ukumbuke the most deaf person Mtu kiziwi zaidi ni yule ambaye hasikii yale anayeambiwa. The most deaf person is that one who does not listen to what he has been taught. Lakini hapa ninajua hatuna deaf people watu waliweza kusikia na kuzingatia na watatilia maanani yale ambayo wamefundishwa kumbuka mzazi akikuona anakuwa na matumaini makubwa maishani mwake anaona mtu ambaye atamtoa kwa shida alizo nazo anaona mtu ambaye atakuwa wa kujitegemea yeye mwenyewe yani atakuwa mzigo wake Anaona mtu atakayemtoa katika nyumba ya matope na shida zile zingine. Kwa hivyo don't don't make your family to be a laughing so usifanye familia yako au jamii yako iwe ya kuchekelewa. Na ukumbuke ukifanya mchezo saa hii unaharibu kesho yako your future is in your hands it is not a mystery or a miracle and you cannot blame anybody because of your future your future is in your hands yani maisha yako ya usoni yako mikononi mwako angalia kile ambacho unataka kukua visualize what type of future you want to live and remember your feet will not take you where your mind has never been miguu yako haitakupeleka bahali ambapo akili haijakuweka kwa hivyo wacha kuangalie focus on what matters most in life angalia hii program ninayo watch kwa tv is it adding value to my life Angalia this friendship ama urafiki huu nilio nao una how does it contribute to the future i want to live is it songs that i listen to do they contribute to a bright future i want to live kwa hivyo chochote unachofanya jiulize kinachangia vipi maisha ya usoni ambayo tunataka kuishi and limit yourself with the people of negative thoughts yani ubitenge na watu wa mawazo machafu nyinyi wenyewe mnasema unataka uwe msafi wa nini wa mawazo na matendo so limit yourself with the people of negative thoughts also do not conform to the patterns of this world. Yaani usiige mitindo ya kisasa. Unapata wazazi wa organizations. You have done good. Umevalisha hawa watoto vizuri. Angalia vile wanavyokaa. Mimi sijui mna 
mkoa wapi hii mitindo ambayo kijana ananyoa unanyoa nyumbani yote huku na reza blade lakini hapa katikati piti ziko hapo tano au kumi unapata naye dongi hapo walimbes naye ni nusu ya makalio alafu mtoto anakuletea nyumbani anakwambia mama na baba this is your son in law atunge pena hayo unasikia nini ya vile mlivyo hivi this is how uh, ama hivi ndivyo wazazi wenu wangependa mkuwe so msituaidishe na vile ninavyoangalia kuna kanisa kubwa hapa wadhami wadhami wacha tufuatilie watoto hawa tujue vile wanavyoendelea katika masomo yao katika shule katika jamii zao katika kanisa lao tusiwaje tu wacha tuwafuatilie tukifuatilia kanisa hili jameni hatutakuwa na shida ya kusema uh, shida ya kusema fulani hakwenda kanisa au fulani hakufanya hivi kwa hivyo wadhani tumejiwekea mzigo au huu ni mzigo wetu na watu hawa wakipotea kwa ajili ya uzembe wetu unajua ya kwamba damu uh, dam yao ijue yetu kwa hivyo tujitahidi tuwezavyo pamoja na wasimamizi wa makanisa tofauti wacha tufuatilie watoto hawa watoto tunawapenda sana tumefurahia kuwa hapa na tumefurahia kukubali kufundishwa na kukubali kuwekewa mkono wacha neno la Mungu likaweze kuwa taa ya mbinguni yenu nimesikia vizuri ndio the future is in your hands the past is in your head but the future is in your hands na nimesema you cannot bless anybody because of your bad future kwa hivyo Mungu atusaidie tukaweze kuishi maisha mazuri maisha ya kumpendeza Mungu na kwa Kristo wengine wote nasi pia tujitahidi tuishi maisha ya kumpendeza Kristo ili wakati mmoja tukaweze kukutana na yeye asante sana Mungu awabariki na wapenda wote
ambayo inaelelea kwa ajili ya pastor na naomba sisi wote tujiandae hiyo pastor itakuwa mwezi wa kumi na itakuwa vizuri tukiwa na hiyo pastor hapo nyuma kwa kumaliza ili posto tumeendesha hivi kidogo na hata huku nyuma kulikuwa hivi itakuwa vizuri zaidi so that we can pass the first one in the world. If we can get the other one, we can get the other one. And we can get the other one. And we can get the other one. And we can get the other one. So we can get the other one. So we can get the other one. If we can get the other one, it will be good. It will be good. It will be good. It will be good. Because we can get the other one. Wana mbona walikayana? Wana mbona walikayana? Tujiunge na hawa wazee. There is a lot we can learn from them. Aka pertains sacrifice and other things. Tujiunge na wao kwa tie nguvu. Kwa tie nguvu na tuweze kukamilisha kazi. Imetoka mbali. Tuje tunaenda mbali. Na I wish for Christo or Masana Mom to do a mom and all women on that. Now, I'm going to do it. Because all the men on the land book, they want us to manage the Kanisa Araka with the Kana. To the Kanisa with the Kanisa Araka with the Kana. Now, to the people who are not asking the first one to manage it. We can come together that morning. Is it possible for us to go to the hostess? Go to the hostess. It was to go to the hostess. Then we might have a lot of money in the cash flow. Can we start? It means that we can just come here and get a shame. For us. And imagine if we can find a calculation in the area of God. We can find a calculation in the area of God. za utoko. Kwani zile sabu za watu wale ambao ni wa wanaheshimika. Na nikasema kama dawsi si masomo na kama kuna Kristo 3000. 3000. Na kila Kristo ani aseme tu huko hapa nataka kumtumikia Mungu. Na kila Kristo kwa kutoa shilingi 100 kwa siku. Kwa siku moja that's how much to That is 30,000 Christians times 100 shillings. Huh? 3 million. Sikumoa? Sikumoa. 3 million. 3 million times 30 days. Huh? Huh? 90 million. 90 million. 90 million times 12 months. One point three. One point four billion. One point eight billion. Imagine project in Kenya to come out with that money that America is only a five hundred pound. So if you want to send me a call to find me, what Christo knows in the house. 15,000 Christians. 15,000 Christians. Tutakoku mimaliza yu kazi kwa mwaka mwani. Wana. Kwa mwaka mwani. Mwani. Wasa tutukue kwa Christo every time. Na tutakoku tutaka kujenga hostess hapa. Na hawa Christo kiyo wafali niku yu. Just every time. Wakusu elfutano, mia moja, kila siku. That will be how much? Half a million. Half a million times 30 days. Fifteen million. Fifteen million times 12. Ukijenga hapa poster ya 200 million. Kwa 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 k
mama anakunda kumkia wapa anakunda wapa anasema run today walk tomorrow kwa toto run today walk tomorrow what has today ukienda wapu saka ni mwana principal fanya biki kwa shuru fanya biki kwa shuru run today walk tomorrow and if the devil of the son of God learn to run today to make a sacrifice today in five years to come this devil will be respected he devil is the God respected and so when you look at the corner this is the corner and 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 this is the corner Inatoka kwa moyo sio mimi ambao wa mtu wangu wana inatoka kwa moyo. Ukiona mimi wana kwa sema Mungu anataka kusamehe. Hata kwa kwa nini ambao Mungu anafai. So I pray ya kwamba kwa Kristo wa sema kwamba should not to run today. 